Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Tuesday, 14th of March 2023. These trades here were shared by MG, who's trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFT using a Forex broker. His macro chart of one hour is in sideway, and you can see that uh, still uh, the price is going down. And we can see the trading channel whether using 15 minute structural chart and by using one minute trading chart he identified the area that pullback got completed and based on algo one to five he was able to identify two entries here one here close with exit strategy number one and the second also entry after completion of pullback was closed with profit so thank you mg for sharing your trades with us the next few trades were shared by Castro, our global instructor, who's trading here Brent Oil CFD. And as you see, the macro is in downtrend. So you can see that in one hour chart, he identified using a smaller time frame the rejection of price at the support area and entered here with setup C with very tight stop loss and very high win to loss ratio. And we can see that the price reached almost his target. Also, he traded Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFT using a Forex broker. Again, you see the macro one hour chart. And again, setup C was used in this side way. The price was rejected at this point. So he entered with very tight stop loss and very high win to loss ratio. And the price is also almost at the target. So thank you very much, Castro, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Yan, or global instructor, who's trading NASDAQ futures. As you see, his macro one hour chart is in uptrend, and you can see the same in the 10 minute trading charts. And the price is very bullish, so using two minute structural chart, he identified area that was going up. So we took long positions using 10 second trading chart in this area. And after rejection of price, he took short position for this channel that is going down and is reversal. So we can see that the result of these trades uh, for the day was profit factor of 2.96 with about 78% win rate and average win to loss ratio of 0.84. And the largest winning trade was 360 and the largest losing trade was $204. So thank you, Yan, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those I have taken at the beginning of New York market session and the video with explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that I have taken on Tuesday, 14th of March, 2023. These trades were taken at the beginning of New York market session on Eminis of the NASDAQ and also Russell. And if you see the macro on the daily chart, uh, yesterday we had the level of 11,700 tested on the daily chart on uh, NASDAQ, and that got rejected. And it was kind of wide range sideway, but anyway, this price got rejected. And if you look at hourly charts today, we see that after market, uh, went up again, retested another level here uh, that was previous day close. And during global session, this level of 11,900 got tested. And we have a kind of point of control here. So, and eventually it broke up. And let's look at the five minute charts. If I open it, and so these are the moves during the global session. And we see here that this level got tested and got rejected, retested, and created this point of control. When the market opened, it just uh, went up and again, a uh, little bit uh, went down, but it was very bullish. So we see the 930 was very bullish the pullback wasn't as strong, so it didn't come back to retest this level, just it was a little bit choppy and it started to go up. Uh, so 
there wasn't any deep pullback and I just traded this uptrend channel based on these green candles here and these are the channel that I see on my structural chart is uptrend again when it went down retested one more time went all the way close to the 12,100 and again retested so I took setup C here and B and again some setup T here and we see that this channel got traded again so using 10 second trading charts all of these moves were taken uh, with long positions and also that was on Nasdaq and micro Nasdaq we could see the same channel of uptrend in the Russell and this Russell uptrend channel of the 10 second trading chart got traded and the result of all these trades were copied from each chart to multiple Apex Trader funding accounts. So we see the results that was replicated by Copy Trader and we reached profit factor of 6.53 with the percentage of win which was 73% all from the long sides and the average win to loss ratio was 2.4 and the largest winning trade was $180 and largest losing trade was $74. I uh, hope these trades taken by the PAT system for fast scalping is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.